Okay, day seven. We're about to leave uh, the Serpentine Chalet Gorge, or Serpentine Gorge campsite. Sorry, not Chalet. We um, camped up in there last night. The dropping the food box back in the thing this morning, it started to rain. So there's, it's not predicted. So we'll see how that goes. I was going to jump in Ello Creek for a swim today with this shirt anyway, so it might save me going for a swim. Anyway, all good. We'll um, catch you later. Oh, yeah, I'll, in case you haven't guessed, we're heading to Ello Creek. All right, catch you later. Yep. First thing in the morning on the trail, squeezed under a tree. Uh, can't complain, it's about the first one in seven days. So the day promises to be fairly uneventful. And there's no high ridge walks today. So we're gonna swing through the range on another through another pass that I've never been through today. So um, we're going to Alley Creek North. Promises just to be interesting. I had visions of swimming and sitting on the beach all afternoon. It's meant to be 28 here today. Uh, it's blue. You never know. Oh, the sun's coming out. So that'll be our pass back through the ranges, the heavy tree range to the other side. So we're passing through what could, what may or may not be called Spring Gap. Um, first time I've ever been in here. It's quite nice walking, be good in a hot day, plenty of shade. So it's a bit gray and brooding, but it's still got its own and we're enjoying the, um, the coolness of it all today a little bit. Hope it clears this afternoon though because I want to go for a swim. So we're just tracking along this gully. Looks like it's been burnt over there. It's been really nice this walk on this side of the range. under blue sky up there too. Yep, it just goes on. Yeah. So we're just um just about at Ellery Creek Dig Hole and the camp we're heading on the north side. The track on the north side is heaps better than the south side. So it's probably not around about eleven o'clock. We didn't leave them after daylight. Oops. Um, and we're almost there. We were just mucking around. We're not going too hard. This rain hasn't kind of this light rain has kept up though. I was hoping to be doing a bit of swimming today, as I mentioned. But it's not looking good at the moment. I don't know if you saw those features. There's the hut in front of us, just come into view. 
Our day's walking is almost over. Before lunch. Woohoo. There's the hut down there. Yeah. You're on video, get in the water. <laughs> You're going to see the tourists. Yeah, go in. <laughs> Just uh, been for a swim. The weather's uh, picked up a bit. Oh, it's still a bit cloudy. I'm shaking a bit because I'm still freezing cold from the swim. But anyway, I guess I'll drip dry eventually. Our friend Yo swam right through. The water must be all of 10 degrees. So this is, um, so we're at Allery Creek North Camp now. We're just using the shelter to cook. We've got our clothes spread out all over the place, drying. We've had a bit of a swim in the gorge. The sun's come out this afternoon. So it's a similar setup. I haven't shown many of the camps because there's always people around. So each camp's got like, it's got a toilet. There's the toilet in the distance. You got a tank, you got the shelter. And then on the other side of the shelter, there's another tank. Inside the shelter, there's a couple of platforms to sleep on. You probably get about six people on each platform, I guess. There's a nice information board there with all the information about the walk. Logbook. There's, there's um, little lockers to put your food in at night, I guess. So that's to keep the animals out. It should keep pretty clean. And there's um, yeah, another tank out this side and a bit of a view. We camped down the creek, so can't quite see it from here. But down near the gap down there, there's, some, there's a flat sandy terrace where we're camped. And I might actually sign off from down there tonight. Okay, here's our setup at um, Allery Creek North. We're on a sandbar on a shelf just out of the gorge. Gorge is down there. Um, it's a pretty nice spot. There's a big, big sandbar here that goes for 100 metres, plenty of spots. Um, so, yeah, we did a pretty easy day today, about 13 k's, something like that. Put the details at the end. Um, it was almost flat, a little bit, a little bit rocky through the gap. I think it's spring gap, but I'm not sure. One day I'll have a look at a book. Um, and yeah, we spent the afternoon just basically sitting at the hut, waiting for the rain to stop for about three hours. Then stuck in a swim, which hopefully I've got some video of. You'll hear me squealing. Um, and now it's going to be an early night. Tomorrow, maybe we'll see how we go. See where we get to. Anyway, see you then.